Hello everyone, in this video, I will be showing you how to make consistent characters in your Nardo AI. So first, you just have to go to any web browser, type in Nardo AI, create your account. So they will ask for an email address and password. You can log in via Google account, Microsoft account, and Apple account. So once done, this is what it looks like. And what you want to do here is to just simply go to this area on the left side and click this image generation okay once you tap this one you will see here other options such as you know ai image generation type a prompt so what you're going to do here is to think of a not just one keyword or prompt but it's like an idea of what you want to really ask from leonardo ai so as you can see here i ask you know the AI to create an AI-based image generation, a young girl with her faithful dog. Not just that, the girl should also be portrayed engaging in a natural and joyful activity such as walking, playing, or sitting, and so on. Now, you can tap this add negative prompt to filter or to type words that you don't want to include or you don't want to see on the result such as you don't want to see other animals just one dog you don't want to see two heads you don't want to see two faces and so on so you must be very specific here you can type as much as you can okay so once done uh, you have added this negative prompt then you can tap this generate ai and you will just simply see the result right here okay so this is the result. So we have here forest, we have here girl and the dog, and I chose four images. So I can select any from any of this here. You can also tap one image if you just want to uh, see one result out from that prompts that you asked from Leonardo AI. So here I have to select this one. Now, if you're okay with this, then all you have to do is simply download this okay so you can now download the image or you can choose the other one everything is up to you now what we're going to do next is to simply go to this area which says image to image so as you can see we have or they have new feature here click the show me then you will see this one and all you have to do is to upload the image that you have downloaded earlier from your data ai so here it is so once that we have this image that we downloaded from this same tool, what you're going to do is to simply, you know, if you want to edit more of it, then you can simply ask or type another prompt or keyword that you want to add. Let's just say from trees and greenery, let's change this to, let's just say mountains and river. So let's see if it will change the image. Click Generate AI. And yes, here it is. So as you can see, there's a river down here. And as you can see, the background is a mountain. Okay. Now, if you want to change or to add another word or keyword or prompt, again, you can change this to instead of playing, you can change this to running and so on. So let's just say... I want to delete some words here or prompts here or idea right here. For example, this one, I want to delete this part. Okay. So you can delete this part and you will see the result. Okay. Just delete this. And I want to change this area right here. I change this to the girl is sitting. If you remember in the picture, the girl is standing. So I want to change it to. The girl is sitting and then, you know, um, let's just say in a chair, okay, like facing the mountains and river, okay, everything is up to you. Okay, and then once done, all I have to do is to click generate and let's see the result. Okay, so if you see, yes, now the girl is sitting. So that's it. And if you notice the dog is not here, but you can also include or delete the dog. Everything is up to you. And that's it. That's how easy it is to make consistent characters in your Nardo AI. Out from an image from this tool, you can simply delete, add more prompts and words to change the image that you have downloaded from your Nardo AI. 
So if you have found this video helpful, please leave a like and subscribe to our channel. Thank you for watching and see you in our next tutorials.